This is Jana Stokes Nauman, and I wanted to answer the question that I get asked all the time is to my kid has dyslexia, what are the best books for them? And that one's kind of hard because dyslexia is so unique. It, um, you know, some kids have problems with comprehension, some kids have problems with coding and figuring out the words. So it just kind of depends on the child. But overall, we're, there are two books that um, I would suggest that mostly could help with dyslexia. And these are Billy B. Brown and Hey Jack. And I'm going to tell you a little bit about why they're important. Most kids are diagnosed somewhere around third grade. Um, so therefore, they've been struggling with read. These, I would guess, are somewhere around the first grade reading level. So they've been struggling with reading for a while and they're diagnosed. And that's why they are where they are. So the one thing about these that's so simple is that they're anywhere from 30 to 40 pages. So kids who have dyslexia see all the other third graders reading books, chapter books, and they're like, well, I want to read chapter books. Well, they can't read the chapter books because it takes them a lot longer to um, read the information. So in these particular books, the print is big. And because the print is big, that's going to help them a lot because it's going to take them twice as long to read a page as a normal as a normal child. So therefore, they're still reading even though um, the print is much bigger. It's also simpler for them to see, and it's also easier for them to code. If they're being taught the Orton-Gillingham method, they're being taught how to code. So when they get to a difficult word, it's easy for them to code because the print is big. The other thing that's hard about kids who have dyslexia is finding subject matter of, the, of that they're going to really get into. The one thing about Billy B and Hey Jack that I really like a lot is they're really empathetic. They really feel a lot for people and they feel a lot for their parents and they're just really empathetic. And kids who have dyslexia are also like that. So they're going to really identify with these characters a lot. And um, what's special about them is actually the friendship between the two. Because kids who have dyslexia, sometimes it's hard for them to make friends. And they kind of miss that. So if they do have a special friend, they'll definitely understand. But they'll enjoy reading about that. Also, the plot lines are simple. C having dyslexia, if you have problems with comprehension, you have a hard time understanding the text. So if the plot line is simple, simple story, then you get to a climax and then everything changes and it gets better. So if, if they can follow along with that, that's the other really good thing. So find these with Usborne Books and more, but these are the best. In my opinion, if your district does R, they are um, AR books, so they can check on comprehension too. But they're just really good for kids with dyslexia. So thanks.